Hi guys, this is George, back here with another video and welcome to the 11th episode of the Theme Park Weekly News Updates. Before we start off, I do just want to say uh, if you are wondering why Parks Reopening Weekly Show wasn't uploaded this week uh, that was because there wasn't any theme parks to talk about. So, just to let you know in case you were wondering where it is, it's not been delayed or anything, it just wasn't going to happen this week because there wasn't any news on Parks Opening and to be honest I don't think we're going to be getting any more news from parks opening because, well, you're just not really hearing about it anymore. Most theme parks are open now, so I'm 90, 98% sure that we've had the ending of Parks Reopening Weekly Show. So there we go, very short notice, but that that's just how it's going to be. I don't think there will be any more episodes of Parks Reopening Weekly Show. But here we go, it's the 11th episode of the Theme Park Weekly News Updates. Let's get straight into this week's episode. We've not got too much to talk about this week, which means that I can uh, talk a bit longer than I normally would, because as you guys know, I love to ramble on for some reason without realising I'm doing it. Without realising I'm doing it. But here we go, let's get into it. So then guys, the first bit of news this week is about Cheetah Chase at Holiday World. That's now open, and I know, that's exactly what I'm thinking too. Very short notice, I mean, I didn't even know this thing was opening. I didn't see anything about the park posting it on Instagram. I also didn't, I didn't hear anything of it until Taylor from Coaster Studios went to ride it. So without Taylor, I wouldn't even know that this thing was open. So, but here we go. So I am going to show you a POV in a minute that the park did release. It is an animated POV, but it is a full POV of the whole thing. And you see both sides of it as well that are that has come directly from the park. So I will be showing that in a minute. But if you don't know what this is, it's their third water coaster. It's the world's first launched water coaster. That's how they're branding it. This thing looks really fun. So you start off going through a dip out the station, then you launch and then you go upwards into, I have no idea what to call it, but you know, have you guys ever been on a water slide where it's a big bowl? So you can get them where you sit in a ring and you also get it where you, where it's just a body slide. And then you go through and then there'll be a hole in the middle and then if you're not in a ring you'll just fall straight through but if you're in a ring you'll go inside it and then there'll be a tube leading you to the end if you guys have ever been on one of those imagine one of those bowls but imagine going round it just as a banked turn there's a few of those on cheetah chase and holiday world at holiday world well it's not actually at holiday world it's in splash and safari which is the water park there they've already got two other water coasters there a uh, wildebeest which was the world's longest water coaster i believe then they topped it with mammoth and now cheetah chase is there but that's not the world's longest that's quite short 
but there are many different drops and sections where it launches you upwards and the first launch at the beginning it looks really good fun and I've uh, been following the construction quite a lot I've showed you a, I've mentioned it a few times on this channel in the news showing the construction and now it's finally open so hopefully one day I will get out there to Holiday World we'll probably hopefully have two days there so we can have one day at the park and one day at Splash and Safari because I'd really like to go and ride those the three water coasters there they all look really really good fun but there we go Cheetah Chase is now open at Splash and Safari at Holiday World very exciting here is the video from the park of this brand new water coaster So then guys, the second bit of news to talk about this week is about another attraction opening. This is Orion at Kings Island. A few days ago was the pass holder preview I be and now the ride is officially open, which is very, very exciting. So if you don't know what Orion is, it's the brand new roller coaster at Kings Island. It's a B&M Giga coaster. It does reach a top height of 287 feet, so you may be thinking, that's not a giga coaster that's a hyper coaster it does have a 300 foot drop so therefore i would consider it a giga so basically this is kind of similar with apollo's chariot apollo's chariot doesn't quite reach 200 feet but it does have a 200 foot drop so it's, it's one of those really it's kind of a similar situation but i would consider orion a giga and i'd also consider apollo's chariot a hyper but here we go so basically it's the tallest fastest and longest steel coaster at king's island uh and it looks like an incredible ride it's my top bucket list coaster it's got various different air time hills. it is a giga coaster but it does have more of a hyper coaster layout so Normally with a Giga Coaster, you just need to look at Intimidator 305, Fury 325. They're not so much known for the huge airtime hills. They're more known for really intense twists and turns and low to the ground elements. However, with Hyper Coasters, they have big airtime hills, big turnarounds, and that's kind of what Orion is. So yeah, there we go. Orion at Kings Island is now officially open, which is very, very exciting. So then guys, I didn't mention it in the last clip, but uh, there is actually an on-ride POV of Orion on my YouTube channel already. I uploaded it a few days ago. It looks brilliant. But I'm going to put an on-ride POV for you in this video as well, just to make the video a bit more interesting, just so it's not me talking the whole time. So then we'll have footage on Cheetah Chase and we'll also have footage on Orion. So here we go, enjoy.
then guys that is now the end of this video here thank you very much for watching make sure to follow me on instagram at george kelly roller coasters george william kelly and george kelly animals message me on snapchat at george kelly follow me on twitter at george kelly and check out my other youtube channel as wealthy eagle thank you very much for watching remember to like comment share and subscribe stay safe everyone and i will see you all later bye